speaking to Joseph Kosselman? Yes. It is my great honor to tell you that you have been chosen to receive this year's Nobel Prize in Literature. Mr. Kosselman, welcome to Stockholm. We'll be providing you with anything you need. Tell me this isn't some great big joke. It's all real, darling. <laughs> <laughs> David, your short story. I think it's beautifully written. Enjoy, enjoy from Sylvia Fry. Who the hell is Sylvia Fry? One of your characters, Dad. Don't be hard on him, David. He's tired. Mr. Kesselman, I have gotten an offer to write a book about Joe. A writer writes, because if he does not, his soul will starve. I have read Joe's earlier work. It was very odd how much better his writing became after he met you. You're talented, I hear. I love to write. It's my life. Don't do it. Don't ever think you can get their attention. <laughs> I'd like to introduce the Kosselmans. Hello, I'm Joan. Oh, my wife doesn't write. I can't do it. I can't take it. I can't take the humiliation. Tell me you believe in me as a writer. It's only your first draft. This relationship's doomed. You're the girl with a golden touch. I think you are sick and tired of being invisible. Without this woman, I am nothing. Do you have an occupation, Mrs. Castleman? I am a kingmaker. There is nothing shameful about what we do. I'm going to tell you everything.